Hey, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. All right, so let's see what's going on. We're going to start with Aries. Aries, what's your energy? All right, Aries. Looks like uh, you're headed in a new direction. Blocking a lot of different energies and things coming your way. Oh, my goodness, yes. What's going on, Aries? All right, all right, all right. I see you. I see you. Yes. Aries, some of you actually may be walking away from a job here. Uh, it doesn't have to be. However, Yeah, some, some, I don't know who this is going to resonate with, but sweetheart, somebody here is deciding to walk away from a job or a source of income here. Um, <laughs> I don't know why I just got Uber. It's weird. Okay, so yeah. Um, you're leaving some things behind here, most definitely, sweetheart. And, um, you're, you're watching how you move too. You you got a plan in in uh, in order here. All right. So it looks like you checked out the situation, seeing what's best for you, and deciding to move to something else that's actually going to make you more money, bring in more stability here. All right. Um, there may be a lot of habits and things like that, or people that you're leaving behind as well. And it looks like some type of journey that you're going on. There could be some type of possible uh, travel here involved. And someone here, you do get a lot of recognition. There's going to be a lot of recognition for whatever it is that you do. You possibly get a lot of that already. But it looks like there is someone here in particular that is paying, uh, paying close attention to you. There's somebody here that possibly wants to work with you, collaborate with you. Um, also, someone here uh, might want to learn from you as well, okay? They might seek you out um, to be a mentor to them and actually pay you for these services here, okay? Um, some of you might actually be in the business of where uh, you have a profession. Maybe you're an entrepreneur and uh, you actually have a skill set that could actually help others. So you might want to think about, you know, being an instructor or something like that or offering some type of classes on whatever it is that you do here. Because this could actually be a great money maker, okay? It could actually bring in you more money than what you're actually doing for, um, for income right now. But I do see you moving on successfully. And you are getting the attention of many, but there's someone here in particular. Yeah, there's something here that came to the light here that you're actually, like I said, you know, is a great opportunity for you. Um, this may be, you may have gotten some information, some contact from someone, maybe from more than one. This may have expressed some type of interest or told you, you know, hey, you know what? You would do very well in this area. Maybe you should consider it. Let's see. Give me the seven of swords. Oh, shit. This might bring some balance into your life as well. Steady income, okay? Steady, steady income. Yes. And this is something that you have a lot of love for as well. Something that you're very good at. Straight, cut, and dry as well. And I do believe there's something that you're going to be letting go of to move forward towards this opportunity. Collaborating with others. Celebration. Maybe this is something that you did in the past that you're thinking about going back to. And like I said, there's some communication coming in here that's going to um, open up an opportunity for you. Yeah, You might have had this opportunity or someone tell you this before, but you might have resisted it. But yeah, somebody's definitely rushing in to tell you, hey, you know what? Now is a great time for you to actually get into this situation here. Um, 
I actually possibly want to invest to help you out. You know, I will back you. I will give you the funds to do whatever it is that you need to do. I, I believe in whatever this is that you are doing here. Let's see. Yeah, there's definitely going to be forward movement here. This might actually involve travel. There's definitely going to be transformation here. There's going to be some good time celebration. There's more money coming towards you. You're going to actually be able to relax as well. So, I, oh my God, look. Someone here has an opportunity to make some good, good money. Okay, good, 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 good money. The pentacles. Yes. Step out on faith, sweetheart. Take this, take it and run with it. Take it and run with it. This is your baby. All right, let's see. Yes, take this leap of faith. Think about it. Pray about it. Manifest it. Bring it to fruition. Go after it. There's someone here that loves what you do. Yes. They want to move forward with you, okay? They want to move forward with you. This person believes in whatever it is that you're doing, and they want to help you get it off the ground. Right now, you might be starting something small, doing it in very small increments. And you might see, you know, a little bit of growth here and there or whatever, but there's a way to market yourself if someone here wants to help market what you do. And help it grow. There's something that you do here already, but you're able to put a twist on it. It's almost like a I'm getting spinoff. Like you see those shows, it's a really good show. And all of a sudden they take some of those characters and they say, okay, you know what? This show did 15 seasons, 10, 10 on the clock. All right. Something is ending. Something else is beginning, sweetheart. There's a new cycle coming about. Yes. This is a new season coming into your life. Moving forward. Moving forward. You don't see this coming. You don't see this coming. You got abundance coming. You got a spinoff coming here. So there's something that you're naturally good at. Naturally gifted. And someone sees your potential and you're about to be hit with an idea, an opportunity here. Oh my. Why am I getting spinoff? Look at this. You're going to have the chance to be your own boss here, sweetheart. Straight entrepreneur. You have to say so. I told you this is your baby. You got the, oh my God, the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Look at this. Something that you love, sweetheart. This is yours. This is yours for the taking. I don't know what this is. Whatever you're doing, take it and run with it, sweetheart. Take this opportunity. The will of fortune is in your favor. See, there's divine guidance here as well. This is what you're meant to do. This is your calling, sweetheart. New beginning through communication. Yes, yes, yes. You might have blocked it before. And someone here is going to get a lot of offers. You might get a lot of offers at this time coming in and nothing seems right. And you're like, no, nah, this doesn't seem like the thing for me to do. This doesn't seem like the thing for me to do. When this offer comes in, don't be so quick to say no. There's a blessing in disguise here that you're not seeing. Be open to movement. Be open to change. Someone here is about to become a star. Whatever it is that you do, someone here is about to get to see. Oh my God, look at this. Aries. Sweetheart, I don't know what you're doing. Whatever work you're doing right here, sweetheart, you need to just go on and run with it. You got brand new opportunities coming for you. Divine is watching you, sending the right people to you to give you this opportunity. And it's going to multiply. What starts off small, the mustard seed, is going to grow into something that you would have never imagined. Yes. 
the thing is, is that don't be afraid to walk away from something else, to close the doors on something else. Multiple opportunities, things you got going on, try something new. With this new opportunity, it's going to be very abundant. Your cup will overflow. Run after it, sweetheart. Okay? Wow. I told you somebody wants to work with you. They want to work with you. Yes. It's going to be a lot of hard work, but it's going to be well worth it in the end. Okay? All right. Let's see. I think I'll go ahead and do Leo. Ooh, that's good, Aries. Look at you. My, 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 my. I wish I had Aries in my chart right now. <laughs> all right, let's see. What's going on for Leo? I'll do all fire signs. All right, Aries. Leo. messages do we have for Leo? Messages for Leo. What messages do we have for Leo? Hi, Leo. Okay, Leo. Messages for Leo. You showed up? Mm. Okay. Give me two more for Leo, please. Oh, look at this. I like it. All right. Leo, it looks like you let some adversity send you into prosperity. You didn't let what hurt you, what harmed you, stop you. You used it to your advantage to bring you some type of abundance here. Yes. Yeah, see, look, there was something that was trying to hold you back. Some drama. Negativity, somebody that was really trying to cause you harm. Try to see, try to make you fail. Wishing your downfall. Bad things that happened in the past, sweetheart. But you used it to your advantage to start something new. And it's actually going to bring you some type of abundance here. You didn't fail and fall in the face of adversity. You're putting in the work, sweetheart. There's a lot of work ahead. Take that leap of faith in a new direction. There's something coming for you that is here. Oh, my God. All right, fire signs. I see you. I see you. Come on now. Come with it. Yes, I like it. I like it. All right, so you didn't let what was meant for your harm hurt you or hinder you. You use it as your stepping stone, your motivation to keep going, sweetheart, because what you don't do is fail in the face of adversity. Having that can-do attitude, I'm a warrior, not a worrier. Ten of Pentacles, facing your abundance, accepting that abundance. Yes. Come on now. Doing the work, doing the work, putting in the work, keeping that fire alive, that passion, that drive. Okay, sorry, just got a message, a weird message. Wow. Hmm. All right, distractions, not letting distractions hold you back. Give me more for Leo. Yes. There's an offer coming in. You might have somebody that's trying to come in from the past, bring you some type of apology here. Doesn't necessarily mean an apology. Look. There could be some type of offer coming towards you. If you were having some type of financial issue, sweetheart, having some type of financial issues here, it's about to come to an end, okay? Your household is going to be just fine. If you were on the outs with your partner or not with anyone, I see this is coming for you as well. Highly intuitive. Also, I see that you're keeping a lot of your game plan, a lot of your moves to yourself, keeping it closed off. 
not letting everybody know what you're doing, just moving in silence, doing what you do, bringing balance into your life. Justice is about to be served, sweetheart. Looking forward towards the future. You got something coming in here. Definitely got something coming in here. Two of Cups. Yes, you got communication coming in here as well. Seven of Pentacles. An opportunity is rising for you too. A brand new start. Starting from the ground up with the Seven of Pentacles, ending up with the Ten of Pentacles, bringing you financial abundance, financial stability with that home. Four of Wands. There's an offer coming in. It may not be all super big or whatever, but it's going to grow. Give it time. Yes, taking a leap of faith in a new direction, sweetheart. In the face of adversity. Don't let it keep you in this energy. All right? Take a break. Woo Heal and get back on your grind. There's work to be done. Sources working with you as well. And also bringing the people that you need to collaborate with you. To help you along the way. From those that were trying to hinder you, stop your progress, bring drama and conflict in your life. Knowing when to, wow, knowing when to hold them, knowing when to fold them, all right? Knowing when to cut people off, cut situations off, drama. Mm -mm. Moving past it, not letting it burden you, not letting it weigh you down. Focusing on what you need to do here, all right? Doing the work, getting unstuck, taking control over this situation. Oh, look, look at this. Look at what you got coming in, sweetheart. Look at what you got coming in. What someone meant for your downfall, you're using it as a stepping stone to move forward and it's bringing great things in your life right now that you don't see you're not expecting be open to change Let's see lover shows up on the bottom of the deck with the world oh with the ace of wands oh my gosh okay Taking time to heal your heart, heal a situation, moving forward, focusing on yourself, not wearing your feelings on your sleeves, sweetheart. Getting over and getting through the things that were trying to keep you stuck, working through the issues that you had. Not allowing anything to keep you bound and trapped and held down. Taking that leap of faith in a new direction. Trusting in the divine. Divine intervention here. Hmm. Using your intuition. Not telling your game plan to all. Some of you actually may be putting out information. Making people... Oh my goodness. Some of you actually may be... Putting out information to others to see how they act. Separating friend from foe. At this point in time, you might be put in a position right now where you see who you're... Oh my goodness. Who's intending to capture you, keep you stuck. Those that are praying for you and those are praying against you. Praying. Let's see. Everything is being revealed at this time. Look at this, Two of Cups. You have a divine connection coming in. <laughs> you're blocking out a lot of things, a lot of people at this situation because you're focusing on you. You know your worth. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Protecting your space and your energy. You've gone through a lot. You've learned a lot. You've learned to protect your space, your energy. Something that tried to knock you off balance. Something that tried to keep you stuck and held back. You're moving forward in the face of adversity. There may be a financial pinch right now, but there's something that's coming in 
to help you out, get you out of this situation. What did I just say? There's work coming for you, sweetheart. A lot of work. But it, with that work brings a lot of abundance here. Keep doing whatever it is that you're doing. It's going to pay off. Page of Pentacles in reverse. Mm. Oh, my. Oh, my. Not accepting offers that you're not this. Oh, my goodness. I got beneath you. Raising your standards. Not being willing to sacrifice self for temporary for things and opportunities and people that are not going to offer you growth and stability. Focusing on self, putting yourself first. Bringing your dreams and desires to fruition here. That's going to lead to the Ten of Cups. Not giving to every situation that comes towards you. Using discernment and wisdom. Hmm. To bring balance and healing into your life. Yes. And moving forward. There may be some travel here as well. There may be a need to release yourself from certain things. Yes. What did I tell you? All right. Accepting only offers that are deemed worthy. All right. Let's see. Yes. Yes. You know, there's money coming your way, sweetheart. You got all pinnacles. There might have been a period of financial lack at this point in time, but there's a reason because, oh my God, divine held his best out for you. Divine timing. The best is yet to come. Ace of damn pinnacles. Oh my God. Leo, king of pinnacles. Who the magician here? Okay, sweetheart. What? Show me the money. Show me the money. That's all I got to say. Wow. Eight of Cups. There's definitely something that you're leaving behind, sweetheart. A lot of different situations that you're putting to rest and you're moving forward. What? To the Eight of Pentacles. Leo, you better go on up out of here, sweetheart. Do what you do, baby. Do what you do. Manifest this new beginning that you got going on for yourself. Go run with it. Run with it. Don't be afraid to leave it behind. And what you don't see is that you got some love coming your way to a partnership. Okay? Yes. The sweet wish fulfillment. Healing. I like it. Leo. Ten of cups. What? Leo. I'm sorry. I'm excited. All right, Leo. So I'm going to leave it at that, baby. You got money coming for you. It may have taken a time, a minute for it to come through. There may have been a period of stagnation here, a period of lack, so to speak, in love and finances. But sweetheart, let me tell you, <laughs> baby, open your hands because you got some abundance blessings coming for you, okay? All right, so let's get into Sagittarius. All right. Fire signs, y'all better do the damn thing. I'm just saying, look at you. You better go on with it. Go on with it. You didn't let nothing stop you from, you know, prospering, doing whatever it is that you want to do. My love, oh my gosh. Look at that. Look at that. Fire signs doing the damn thing as you should. As you always do, I'm just saying. You don't never let nobody hold you back, sweetheart. Yes, you keep on shining. Keep on doing you. All right. You can't stop the sun. I'm just saying. Mm. Look at that. Mm. Transformation. Look at that. Ah. Oh, my goodness. Keep deciding to move forward. Push forward. Keep deciding to move forward. <laughs> That's the way out. Y'all got to, uh, I'm sorry. Success, abundance. Yes. Yes, run it. I'll take that. Mm. 
Uh, I don't know. We don't, we don't really want to deal with that. But, you know, that means several things here. All right. But karmic justice is being served. Mm. All right. So, anywho, Sagittarius, let's see what's going on for you. All right. What's going on for Sagittarius? Give me messages for Sagittarius. I should have started off with the other deck. Uh-uh, Sagittarius. No, we're not starting with this situation, sweetheart. All right, there may have been something that you were worried, stressed out about, um, uh, not sure what was going to happen. Something unexpected might have happened, came down the way, and you just feeling some type of way about it. But, sweetheart, let me tell you, this is only for a moment, okay? Better days are coming towards you. Trust me, you got new beginnings coming towards you. Um, possibly some type of... of um, agreement here a contract or something like that that uh is going to help you out of this situation okay sweetheart so wusa know that things are going to get better all right so let's see what else mm -hmm. learning how to protect your space your energy control those thoughts your emotions yes we're not letting things get underway all right, holding back from the situation. Also holding your peace. Yes, sweetheart, holding your peace. Look at this. See, I, I, I'm going to put it to you like this. See, you got some adversity. Somebody's trying to come for you, okay? Don't let that get you in your feelings or whatever. Control your emotions, all right? Control your emotions. Put yourself first. Love on you. Take care of you at this point in time. Yeah, see, you got drama, also, I see there's some type of mental conflict here that's going on with you. Worry, stress, anxiety. No, 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 no. We're not going for that one. You have to remember you're a child of the Most High. No weapons formed against you shall prosper, and all things that are meant for your harm will come to an end. And those that are meant to try to destroy you <laughs> will be taken care of. Trust that. Believe that. They can't stop where you're going. You have a divine destination. Stay in your power. You already know who you are. And whose you are. Keep it pushing. Move forward. We don't have time for this. All right? We only stand this for a moment. You are allowed to feel this. But then you got to get up and do what you need to do, sweetheart. Don't let those negative thoughts keep you stuck. Look at things from a new perspective, sweetheart. What was meant for your hindrance will be for your highest good, okay? You, this too shall pass. Yeah. That part. Alright, so what we're not going to do is worry about the situation. Things get better. Trouble doesn't last always. Yes, what did I just say? Get out your head, all right? Get out your head. Move forward, all right? Communication is coming in to give you all the clarity that you need, okay? Source is coming in right on time. May not come when you want them, but it's always right on time, okay? Sweetheart, There's this is only a period, all right? Only a momentary period of indecision, worry, stress. It's time to go within, sweetheart, to look at what look at the bigger picture, okay? Look at this from the 5D, not from the 3D. Don't pay attention to, go, to what's going on around you. Pay attention to what's going on within, okay? It's time to get it right, get it tight. Do what you need to do, all right? All things will be revealed. Healing. Wish fulfillment is coming for you. Just be patient. Yes. Block that negative energy that's coming in or trying to come in. In the tower. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, somebody's trying to block you. Trying to block your blessings. Mm-mm. Something's trying to block your blessings. Trying to block your prosperity. Somebody's behind the scenes trying to block you, cause imbalance in your life. But no, 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 no. Trying to keep you broke, stuck, stagnant. Mm -mm. Look at the bigger picture, sweetheart. Like I said, no weapons formed against you shall prosper. All right? Source is going to give you everything that you need to keep it moving, keep it pushing. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody's trying to keep you stuck. All right. This is a lot going on, sweetheart. A lot going on. Seems to me you got somebody trying to really work against you. Let's see. Yes, now it's time to focus on yourself. You already know. Do what's best for you. Use your intuition in this situation, okay? Tap into that, that resource that you have the most high. Ask for protection. Ask for mental clarity. Ask for mental and emotional healing here. Yes, yeah, see, something here came down. You may have realized that someone that you were close to, someone that you trusted, was trying to break you, break your confidence, break your, oh my goodness, break your belief system, break your connection with source, make you doubt who you are. No, sweetheart, you have new beginnings, new things. Look beyond what's happening here in the 3D. Sergeant, you're making me want to pull some more cards for you, sweetheart. Let's see. You got to look at the bigger picture. Look at the bigger picture. Why is somebody coming at you so hard? See, you must have an abundant blessing on the way, or else you wouldn't be hit so hard with adversity, okay? Don't faint in the face of adversity. Keep it moving. Baby, put them block, boxing gloves on. Get ready to box. Hmm. Just saying. Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, you know what? Somebody is trying to cast seeds of doubt here. Cast seeds of doubt. Bringing in confusion, conflict, drama. Yeah. But what they don't see is that there is something coming for you. An offer. Yes, victory is yours. Victory is yours. Yeah, there were some things that came along that hurt you. Mm-hmm. But you got to get over this, sweetheart. Don't let this keep you stay stuck in regret, confusion. All right, you may be confused as to why this person or these people would treat you such a way. It's time to get over what they've done. Move forward, stand in your power. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all things will be revealed. Look forward towards the future, okay? Keep working on you, keep working, keep working, keep working, keep going, keep going. Don't give up. Like I said, look at things from the bigger picture, sweetheart. You know who you are. Stand in your power. Nobody can stop what God has for you. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? I'll just see this. Give me more. Give me one more. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, somebody knows you got blessings coming. Somebody knows you got blessings coming in trying to do sneaky shit on the low. But they can't stop you. They can't stop you from moving forward. That's what it is. Somebody doesn't want to. Uh. Come and get your blessing. Yes. Look at this. You got some hating ass people around you, Saggy. You got hating ass people that's trying to manipulate a situation all up in your face, smiling, grinning. But in the meantime, they change their faces, change when they're around other people. They adapt themselves. Yes. Oh, my goodness. You got somebody here that's making you small offers here. That page of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody that's offering you something very little, but they're trying to manipulate the situation. Playing games, playing tricks. You don't see their ulterior motive. They're trying to keep you stuck in a situation, but you're moving forward, sweetheart. Open your eyes. Stand in your power. Open your eyes. Let's see. Give me this stuff. Yeah, you're going to be walking away from this situation. 
closing out the cycle here, moving forward. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. Stability is coming your way, sweetheart. Take your power back. You know who you are. You know your worth. Don't settle for this. Don't let it keep you stuck, trapped in your mind. Oh, woe is me. Oh, no. Yeah, see, what did I say? Nine of Wands here. Protect your space. See, this is what they know. You got good things coming for you. The Ten of Pentacles. The Emperor. Yes, the Six of Cups is actually here too, okay? So you got great things and a whole bunch of opportunities coming for you, sweetheart. And somebody knows it. They're trying to challenge you, all right? Challenge your faith. Stay prayed up. This is what we're not getting ready to do, is accept this. We don't accept defeat. King of Pentacles, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Confirm it. Confirm it. Yes. Showing all your enemies. Yes. Strength. Stand in your power, sweetheart. Showing up like the queen and king you are. No weapons formed against you shall prosper. See, let me tell you something. Hold back from some of these people. Just, just hold back what you're doing. Keep a lot of this stuff to yourself. All right? Ten of Pentacles here. The Emperor is here. Yes, sweetheart, I'm telling you. Also, I just saw the Four of Wands here. Stability happening for you, okay? Keep what you're doing to yourself and watch your enemies fall before your feet, okay? We don't accept defeat in a mindset of negativity. Let this BS help you to, to, to move forward even harder. Go harder. Go hard. Go hard or go home. We don't sit down, all right? Pay attention to your circle. Hmm. Anywho, um, wow. Sagittarius, this is a fucking trip. Why are they coming for Sagittarius? Competition magic. Ooh, really? Someone feels they need to compete against you. Mm. That is their motivation for the things that they do. Okay, so somebody see you win, win, winning, okay? Know that you got blessings. You got somebody that's fixated on you as well. Death magic. Someone is out to take something that is yours. This could be love, money, energy. It could be all of the above, okay? Some, some miserable motherfucker is trying to bring you down, okay? But they're already beneath your feet. Put your foot on their neck, okay? All right. Toxic fixation. Someone is attracted to your light and seeking to dim it. Yes. They're also doing reckless magic on you as well, sweetheart. But what they don't know is they're fucking with the a child of the most high. And excuse me because this just pissed me off because, yes, I got Sagittarius in my chart, but you don't know who you're playing with. All right. So check this out. Saggy. No weapons formed against you shall prosper, sweetheart. Okay. And whatever they do, we return to sender with love. All right. So affirmation, I am enough. I have enough. I'm doing enough. You doing enough, but sweetheart, do more. Hmm. All right. We're not going to be petty. I was going to say, fuck it. Piss them off. <laughs> do all you can. Anywho, you don't need to do that. Stay high, vib high vibing. Woo all right. So it says, I am healing the deepest parts of myself each and every day. Yes, you are. And somebody here has some issues that they need to go and work on themselves. But no, they're focused on you, all right? So yeah, all right. I courageously say to myself on a daily basis, I am nurtured, I am cared for. Yes, you are, and you are beautiful. You're gorgeous in every way. All right, refrain from judgments. We all are unique and experience life in our own way. Allow others their journey. Like I said, let them go on and do their thing, sweetheart. 
and you go ahead and do yours. Your spiritual path is being illuminated, okay? So regardless of whatever this is that's trying to come against you, sweetheart, please know that no weapons formed against you shall prosper, all right? Everything is everything and it's working out in your favor, your highest good. All right. Whew. All right. Give me messages. One for Aries. The answers you need are coming, so just hold on and wait. Show the world the real you. Like I said, there's something that you do, Aries, that uh, other people see. They see your potential, and someone here wants to come and work with you, and it's actually going to be very prosperous for you. Give me a message for Leo. Look at the bigger picture. Your hard work is paying off. Leo, keep doing whatever it is that you do, baby. Keep grinding. Keep uh, keep shining. Keep doing the work. Don't let nothing stop you, okay? Don't stop in the face of adversity. And no matter what it looks like, stay on your grind, baby. All right. Give me one for Sagittarius. All right. A new romantic cycle is beginning, okay? The energy is gaining momentum. So, Sagittarius, you got a lot of beautiful things coming into your life, sweetheart. You got some love coming in here. Uh, looks like you got uh, some money coming in here, stability and everything. So, if things kind of seemed like it was a little bit upside down, unfair... You know, you're working your ass off and you're still being hit with adversity. Please know it's because you got somebody that's hating on you, okay, sweetheart? But the more they hate on you, it means that you're doing something right in your life, okay? Um, if you're actually failing in life, there's only so many people that are going to really pay attention to you for too long, okay? But if you got some blessings coming your way, if you got blessings coming your way, these are people, people will gravitate to that and start hating on you for it, okay? So, yeah, there's that. All right, sweetheart, I'm sorry to go on a tangent, but, yeah, that kind of pissed me off. I hate when other people prey on other people, you know? It's really ugly and it's really sad, but, you know, you got those people out here that like to do that. It just shows a lot about them, okay? All right, my loves, you guys take care and thank you for rocking with me. Bye.